Hi, this is Nancy Monroe, and I'm going to take you to a mobile learning site using a BlackBerry. And we're going to access a course that was used as or produced for Java-based content. And what Java does is it actually downloads it directly to my BlackBerry so that I can access it at any time. I don't have to be accessed uh, or on a cell service to download that content. So my company, Knowledge Shift, produced all of this content using Hot Lava's authoring software. So I'm going to scroll to the course that was produced as a Java course. And um, when I do that, this is a course that was designed as a post-class survey for a program that was viewed earlier as a video in a classroom setting. And so I'm searching for the Java file. And in here it says, uh, click here to download this file. And so now it's going to actually download, so here it is, Dogs World Field Survey. And so when I click download, it's going to say, okay, let's go out and uh, get that file off the WAP server. And the nice thing about this is that um, Hot Lava allows you to create a lot of different types of content, and Java is a really great format for folks that want to produce content that's accessible anywhere. Uh, you're always carrying your phone around with you, and you're not always in a cell service. So now it's downloading the Java file. So what happens is this is going to download it as an application, onto my BlackBerry. And as you'll see here, after it's done downloading, then I will actually jump out of Hot Lava's uh, web-based uh, MDTS system, and I'm going to access the course directly from this desktop of my BlackBerry, so to speak. And it's almost done, and it's going to tell me when it's all finished. And here it is. The application was successfully installed, so I hit OK. And now I'm going to jump out to my main screen of my BlackBerry, and there it is. I'm going to launch the course, and here it is. So I have the same navigation tools I would have in the other courses designed using Hot Lava software. And there's an image clip from the video as a visual cue to remind people what was going on in the video at this time. And as you answer the questions, you can upload them to the Hot Lava server to store, or you can wait till you're back online and send them at that time. So it's a great way to produce content using Hot Lava software. Thank you.